This is Chicago's very own WGN News at 9. Good evening, I'm Micah Mater. And I'm Ben Bradley in for Ray Cordopassi. We have more tonight on the life and legacy of Rocky Wirtz. Jarrett Payton starts us off with more. Jarrett? Yeah, guys, uh, one of those things today that just kind of hit and everybody here in the sports office was kind of taken back today. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh, sad news out of the city this evening. Blackhawks principal owner Rocky Wirtz passed away at the age of 70. Wirtz inherited the Blackhawks after his father Bill Wirtz passed away in 2007. But one of the biggest moves that he made was hiring John McDonough to become his president and CEO of the Blackhawks. Both Wirtz and McDonough, they revamped the team's marketing efforts while placing the games on local TV, which they weren't, and securing the radio broadcast rights. Under Wirtz ownership, the Blackhawks, they hoisted three Stanley Cup championships for the city of Chicago. So I think we're going to have a lot more coming from what happened today and also as well getting some more reaction as well from people around the NHL family and the Blackhawks family about the passing of Rocky Wirtz. Thank you, Jared. We are getting more reaction to the death of Rocky Wirtz tonight. WGN's Alyssa Donovan is joining us live from the United Center. Alyssa? Yeah, Micah, Wirtz's family did release a brief statement this evening following his passing, saying that he had a very brief and sudden illness, and that's what he passed away from earlier today. He was 70 years old. Wirtz, as Jared said, was the principal owner and the head of the Chicago Blackhawks since 2007, and he's credited with helping grow the hockey club's brand. Wirtz was also part owner of the United Center, and tonight his picture and his name are up on the screen of the state stadium along with the Blackhawks logo. His passing shocking to many in the sports community, Wirtz leaving behind a legacy in Chicago. Rockwell Rocky Wirtz passed away Tuesday at the age of 70 following a brief illness according to his family. His son Danny Wirtz releasing a statement about his father saying in part, our dad was a passionate businessman committed to making Chicago a great place to live, work and visit. But his true love was for his family and close friends. He was a loving father, a devoted husband to Marilyn, a brother, a nephew, an uncle, and a doting grandfather to his six remarkable grandchildren. His passing leaves a huge hole in the hearts of many, and we will miss him terribly. A very sad day for the Blackhawks and, and for any, anybody associated with the club. Former WGN Sports Director Dan Roan recalls the significant changes to the Blackhawks when Rocky took over the team back in 2007. His father uh, passed away and had Rocky uh, take over the range there in 2007 and really changed the entire culture of the whole thing. I mean, it was a tight-fisted uh, run with an iron fist by Bill Wirtz. And when Rocky took over, he went out and hired John McDonough and company and, and changed everything. Rocky's influence helped grow the popularity of the team, starting with his decision to televise home games. Under his ownership, the Blackhawks won three Stanley Cups and became an NHL powerhouse. While he may be best known for his rebuilding of the Blackhawks, that wasn't the only venture for Wirtz. He had a vast array of businesses, leading his family's successful beverage company, developing the Fifth Third Arena on Chicago's west side, and expanding the United Center campus. And several other Chicago sports teams owners have released statements tonight about the passing of Wirtz and the impact that he had on the Blackhawks franchise. His family also said in their statement today that along with the work he did with the Blackhawks, he also had a legacy of generosity and philanthropy in the Chicago community and the services for Wirtz have not yet been planned. Reporting live tonight at the United Center, Alyssa Donovan, WGN News. A legacy far beyond the sports world. Alyssa so thank you.